Open fire. Rain hellfire, button. In brief days, S-C-R-E-E-N-R-E-N-T-V-I-D-O, scroll to V-I-E do we more John Tanti after the events of Ahsoka, Grand Admiral Thrawn has returned to the known Star Wars galaxy, and his origins might help pave the way for the next major antagonist in the saga. Long before Thrawn became a Grand Admiral and joined the Empire, he was an officer in his own people's armed forces. After being absent from the known galaxy for almost 10 years, Grand Admiral Thrawn eventually discovered a way to return from his exile on the extragalactic planet Paradia, as seen in Ahsoka. Thus, Thrawn was blind to the end of the Galactic Civil War and the fall of the Empire. The unknown regions of Grand Admiral Thrawn's past precede his entrance into the Empire. Thrawn's people, called the Chiss, live in the unknown regions of the Star Wars galaxy, an area of space that is infamously treacherous due to a variety of oddities as demonstrated by Kylo Ren and Rhee's journey to the planet Exegol and Rise of the Skywalker. Topics Head Topics Formerly a talented member of the Ascendancy's expansionary defense fleet, Thrawn was dispatched to the more well-known region of the galaxy that the Chiss call Lesser Space. Thrawn was sent into a fictitious exile with the mission of assessing whether the Republic that had evolved into an empire would be a good partner in the Ascendancy's conflict with the Gris Kegemini. Despite being one of Thrawn's greatest military strategists during the Dark Times, Palpatine ultimately served the Chiss Ascendancy, which Thrawn planned to eventually bolster with the might of the Empire. But that was all before Jedi Ezra Bridger's abrupt banishment from the known galaxy. With Thrawn's return, questions have to be asked about the Ascendancy's current state and Thrawn's future plans for his people. Topics at Topics